Because at the moment I'm doing more editing and grading than I am actually filming, I thought that I would get deeper into the functions that uh, I'm not using, so I'm trying to completely do away with the mouse. Also got the editor keyboard in here. I've done a review of it already, so I'm trying to completely do away with the mouse. I still do rely on it a bit for some things, and even though I've been transitioning over to DaVinci for a while, I'm still not quite down with all of the keystrokes. So my goal for this week, being able to use the scroll wheel to move clips around completely so you can actually slide a whole section of clip along the timeline so you don't have to grab the mouse and drag it along. And that's really cool when you're just finessing edits. It's a little bit different from doing trim in, trim out or roll because you're actually taking that chunk of clip and moving it. And you can choose to um, have that in place and then slip within it or you can slide it along the timeline. So that's something that I'm forcing myself to learn while I've got uh, more time on edits this week. And it's actually already starting to feel more natural. So I'm really looking forward to be able to show the rest of the team. I'm sure they're gonna be thrilled to learn those new little tips and tricks because it's become a cliche in our office whenever anyone moves over to DaVinci. And indeed, we've actually shifted the whole team over now, use this as a catalyst to say, right, all the new edits, everyone's on DaVinci. So whenever anyone's been moving over prior to this, we've had this thing where they all go back over to Premiere or someone will say, oh, uh, could you help me with this edit? And it's in Premiere. And they just stand there and they go, oh, this would be so much easier in DaVinci. And I was doing it and everyone's going, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Paola moved over to DaVinci and she started doing it. And then Ben's moved over to DaVinci and he's going, oh, we could, we could do these animations in DaVinci so much faster, I could just throw them in. So there's all kinds of things which you can pick up, even if you're relatively uh, familiar with the software already. I recommend diving in and seeing what you can learn because now is the perfect time to do it. You've got plenty of time on your hands.